Hey everyone, it's Chris from the Californers, and this week we're visiting Discovery Cube Los Angeles, which isn't all that close to Los Angeles out of Silmar, California, but it does deliver on giving kids a fun time with plenty of things to do while they secretly learn during play. We noticed DCLA's permanent exhibits generally focus on life around LA and Southern California. With fun sections like Santa Ana winds that give kids the chance to shoot clouds into the roof, step into a vortex, or even get into a wind booth that will make them feel what it's like to get hit by the wind's strongest gusts. DCLA also has a few multimedia exhibits on subjects of space, LA sanitation, and tunneling. Out of all of them, our favorite was Cube Studios. The green screen newsroom is awesome if you're willing to follow a few basic production steps to make a fun news clip with your kids. Once you hit submit, the processed video will show up on the TV screens outside in about 10 or 15 minutes. As for our daughters, they really enjoyed the inspection game, where they went around a fake house looking for ways to save energy. They really wanted to love the grocery game as well, but it felt like it was designed for slightly older kids and they couldn't complete it without a lot of help from us. Just past that was a recycling line game. Once it gets going, kids have to find and scan certain items to learn what's recyclable. Halfway through the game, you look around and realize by then, all the parents have taken over and they're trying to win for their kids. So it's a nice rush of unexpected fun if you play it. The second story was home to the Science of Hockey and DCLA's temporary exhibit for Pixar's Inside Out. We specifically went to check out this exhibit and we watched it the day before, so the girls had so much fun playing through the different stations. Each station had a fun little callback to the film and it seemed like every kid loved the memory wall, but other stations seemed a bit broken. The kids didn't seem to mind at all. Rounding out the children's museum was a small section for toddlers to play in and a gift shop. DCLA was a fun visit. We liked the large spacious feel and they invested a lot to provide kids with a unique experience that relies much more on tech than the other children's museums around Southern California. You can check those out here if you're interested and we'll see you next week with more to do around California with kids. Thanks for watching.